Well, the Twins ended up with Toronto in the first round of the Major League playoffs, and the Twins also ended the longest losing streak in professional sports history for playoffs anyway, not just in pro baseball history. Now, Royce Lewis missed the end of the regular season with some hamstring issues, and you don't have to run when you hit it over the fence. Lewis gave the Twins a two-run lead that came in the first inning. His first playoff at bat is a homer. Two innings later, Lewis is up again. His second playoff bat is at bat rather is also a home run and this one goes the other way Lewis drives in every twins run today he had three RBI defense was also outstanding for the home team today Michael A Taylor made a couple of beauties in center and then Carlos Correa keeps the Blue Jays off the board with this one right here that is an awesome play as the twins win it by the final of three to one Pablo Lopez is the winning pitcher game two is tomorrow afternoon. Mandad won the first Class A State Girls Golf Championship in 1966. The Braves' second title came today in Grand Forks. Mandad was one shot better than Red River. The Braves had an excellent 310 yesterday to go along with today's 319. The uh, next highest finisher from the West was Century at number eight. There was no question who the best player in the tournament was. Mandan's Anna Huddle dominated, winning by nine shots. She was two under par today. Hale Height and Medler had the rounds in the 80s today to keep the, uh, help the Braves win that championship. Well, Legacy and Jamestown finished first and second during the regular season to secure a place in the state soccer tournament. They will play for the West Region title on Saturday. Six other teams are vying for the two other spots. Century in the first round hosting Williston. They're the five and the eight seeds. Here's Kevin Ja with time and space, and no one from Williston is closing down on him, so he takes the shot from distance and puts his team up about seven minutes in. The win was a really big factor in this one. The Coyotes could barely get the ball out of its own defensive half. Before Williston knew it, the Patriots were ahead by two. That's Jacob uh, Kavenberg uh, with the uh, goal right there. Then under 10 minutes to go till halftime, it's Kobe Ja who tucks it in in the bottom left corner on a PK. A century would go on to win this by the final of five to nothing. The other first round game, Dickinson, five to three over Mandan. Northern Sun Volleyball on a Tuesday. U Mary is hosting Northern State. U Mary's up one nothing, but the Braves with set point in the second. Northern State goes to Abby Brooks. It was 25-20, and the match is tied one all. U Mary's setter is Cameron Selvig. There she catches the Wolves uh, to even things up in that second set. But the quickest way to get a point is on a serve. Maddie Cooper with the ace, but Northern State would eke out the win. The final here was 3-2. to two. At the Armory, the Mystics hosting Miles Community College. BSC won the first and is up big in the second set. That's Asia Gross picking up the ace and adding another one to BSC's total. Bismarck State would put away the second set with a little help here from Terrence Sieg. She gets the kill from the middle. It was 25 to 9. Third set, it's BSC uh, getting the lead by going outside. Uh, Kaiten Piercy had a team high 13 kills. BSC wins it by the final of 3 to nothing. The Mystics are now 10 and 0 in Mondak play. In high school volleyball, St. Mary's beats Mandan 3 to nothing, Legacy and 4 over Watford City. Century goes to Belcourt and wins. Bismarck goes to Minot and wins. It was Flasher over McIntosh. Trinity beats New England tonight. Central McLean shutting out the Holsteins. South Border and 3 over Wilton Wing. Grant County and 3 straight to topping Garrison in Hebron tonight. Bowman County picks up the win. Hart River over Kildare. Beulah's head coach, Brian Philibeck, gets his 500th win. And in college golf, the uh, Kerry Carmichael from Year Mary was the medalist. The team finished second. The men's team finished third.